Hey guys, it's Tasha here. This video is not a hair video as it usually is. Today is a video about braces, adult braces at that. I'm 23 years old and I am getting braces today. I'm very excited. Um, everybody always looks at me crazy when I say I'm excited about getting braces, but this is something that I've been wanting for a long time. My teeth have, have bothered me now for a while. 10 years kind of since I was about 13 or 14 so now that I can afford it myself I'm going to get them uh, the process really hasn't been too terrible not terrible at all actually I went to the orthodontist in um, June like the beginning of June 8th or 9th or so today is now the 7th of July and I get my braces today uh, the visit usually uh, what the dentist is, is the first ones are free, free consultations. And when you go, they take a bunch of pictures of yourself. I mean, of, of yourself. Of your teeth. And uh, they basically give you this and they take pictures of all of that. This is my most troubling area. These teeth down here, they bother the crap out of me. So. And then I have some like problems up top too with rotated teeth and teeth out of place. So yeah, um, getting that fixed. Uh, yeah, the process, they go in there and take the pictures of you, they look at the teeth, and then the orthodontist comes in and he, he makes up a plan for you. Um, my orthodontist said that I would have to have braces for 18 to 22 months. Uh, being optimistic, 18 months from now would be next December, which isn't too terribly bad. I mean, time goes by super fast nowadays, so, I mean, it's not like I'm going to have braces until 30 or something. <laughs> That's ridiculous. But, um, yeah, and, uh, you know, there's different types of braces. You have the traditional metal, you have the ceramic, which is the enamel color. You have the Invisalign and then the braces that go behind your teeth. Invisalign and the braces that go behind your teeth, I'm not really sure what they're called. Those are the most expensive options. Uh, metal braces, mine's ran me $58.95 and then ceramic is $200 more than that. And that's in my area. I mean, it's depending on where you live and um, the orthodontist you go to. I did really good research on my orthodontist i talked to a lot of people that i know had braces in high school and um, middle school and stuff like that and they recommended my orthodontist so just make sure you're doing your research and make sure you're going to somebody that um won't jack your teeth up more than they already are um but yeah i at first i had opted to get the metal braces but then i changed my mind because when i talk you see my teeth a lot i just didn't want to have like the uh brace face i'll still be a brace face be like the metal head i don't know anyway <laughs> i just opted to have ceramic braces so my total cost came up to 16.95 but my insurance pays two thousand dollars of that so my out-of-pocket cost is 40.95 and uh the way my dentist office does it they have this dental plan payment plan that you can do and um it tells you the total cost plus what your insurance is going to pay the, the length of the month, I mean the length, and then it tells you what your payment options are. I'm not sure if you can see that because I can't see. But yeah, um, you can pay it all in full. They give you like a discount or they give you um, like a payment plan. You can put 10% down or I think this is like 20%. And then you pay a certain amount every month. I'm doing a 10% down. So when I go today, I have to pay $400. And um, every month, I have, to, I have to pay like $160 for 22 months. Of course, you can pay it off early or whatever. There's no penalty for that. And um, here, they draft it directly out your bank account. So that's decent for me. I mean, I didn't realize... You know, it's so easy to get braces. I went ahead my initial consultation on the 8th, and then I set my appointment up to get the braces today. So, um, it's, it's not as complicated as you think it is. But, I'm going to go out there in about 45 minutes. My visit is at 10.15, and it's like 9.10 now. So, I'm going to get there early. Hopefully, get out of there early. 
I want to take a nap. Um, I'm not looking forward to the pain that everyone tells me. I do have a, a prescription for 800 milligram ibuprofen. And I have a prescription for oxycodone. So, I mean, if I'm in that much pain, I have, I'm have i prepared for it. But hopefully it's not too bad. Um, the only problem I'm looking that I think I'm going to run into is I just got this piercing. So stupid. Just got this piercing on Friday. Um, today's Tuesday. So it, it is not at all healed. It still hurts. I don't think it'll catch on to my teeth. And the only reason why it does is if like I'm pushing down onto it. But, you know, when you first get a piercing, they give you a longer bar anyway. So, hopefully the orthodontist doesn't have too big of an issue with that and that it doesn't interfere with me getting my braces today. I'll be so disappointed and so upset with myself. But, um, when I went originally, they didn't say anything about my tongue ring. I did have to take it out to, um, get the x-rays and stuff. But, that was it. They didn't say anything. But, um, hopefully this doesn't cause an issue. I will be back though after I get the braces put on and I can tell you a little bit more about what they did and how long it took and you know things like that but yeah. they're really hard to see you can see the wires but you can't really see the brackets itself It took about, it took about an hour. I got there at like 10, 15 and they didn't see me. It's like 10, 30 and I'm just leaving and it's 12, 20. They had to, they were really busy. They had to keep stopping because the orthodontist himself had a lot to do. Um, they didn't say anything about my piercing, so, and it's not hitting or anything. So that's good. Um, my teeth already feel tender. I'm about to go pick up my ibuprofen um, prescription at the pharmacy. But he, uh, the doctor said it went and start hurting for real until tomorrow, which is horrible because I go back to work tomorrow. But um, what else? Um, I have my next appointment in six weeks. So that's the... They gave me a bunch of stuff, like the stuff to clean in between the wires and toothbrush floss and stuff like that I'll probably get me a electric toothbrush like a Sonicare um uh, what else I don't know it feels weird I feel like I want to talk like take my time talking and my job is I'm a, I'm a working a call center so it's gonna be weird trying to correct myself like make sure I'm taking my time so I'm not speaking um so I'm speaking clearly so the people on the phone can hear me. But outside of that, um, okay. So it did get just now kind of snagged on my brace or the bracket or what. I don't know. It kind of did. So as soon as it heals, I'm definitely going to get a shorter, uh, shorter bar. But outside of that, everything is pretty easy. I'm glad they're not too noticeable. I'm definitely glad I didn't get the metal brackets because eh. <laughs> okay well I'll keep in touch and do like a blog an update every so often okay so <clears throat> it's still day one it's like 5 30 I just woke up from a nap and my teeth are so tender my tongue ring keeps hitting them and it hurts so bad I didn't take an ibuprofen yet because um, I wasn't hurting, so I didn't just want to be taking unnecessary medicine. But I really wish I would have before I went to sleep because now I'm in pain and I'm starving. And I don't want to eat until the medicine kicks in because my teeth hurt. They do. They're not, it's not terrible, but it's bad enough to make a difference. If this is, um, if this is what this feels like today, I can only imagine tomorrow. Uh, I'm not going to keep making videos today because if I keep adding this to this one video, it's going to be extremely long. So, uh, I think this is my last video for today. And I'll come back probably at the end of the week and do like a weekly video or something. I don't know. Still feels weird. 
definitely hurts. Why did I want this? 